Hobby Kids TV. Hey, Hobby Kids, it's Hobby Mac. Super excited to be here with you today. First off, we need to give a big shout out and thank you to Anki. They provided us with this awesome Anki Overdrive Starter Kit. They gave us two extra cars. They gave us Thermo and Nuke. How cool is that? They also provided us with a launch kit, two corner kits, two Anki Overdrive Speed Kits, and the Anki Overdrive Collision Kit. To begin with, we'll be taking a look at the Anki Overdrive Starter Kit. This kit is amazing. Basically what you have here, it's a race car track set, but it's kind of a cross with the video game. You control the cars from your app on your phone or your tablet, and you are ready to race. This starter kit comes with two race cars, Ground Shock and Skull. Here on the side of the box, it tells you what you gotta do. You download the Anki Overdrive app, charge your cars, connect the track, and you're ready to race. Here on the back, it shows the tracks that you can build with your Anki Overdrive starter kit. It's eight different combinations just in this one kit. With all the additions that Anki sent us, we'll be able to really have an unlimited amount of tracks that we can build. You have different game modes. You can race, battle, time trial, have a tournament, multiplayer, or team. Looks like Ground Shock is super fast, but a little low on defense while Skull is a little lower on speed, but has wicked awesome firepower. They each come with an exclusive weapon. Ground Shot comes with Electro Pulse, and Skull comes with Plasma Cannon. So now that we got the box open, you can see everything that comes in the starter kit. You see the charging base, also see the risers in here, the four car charging base, which is awesome. Even though it only comes with two cars, you're ready to charge four. This is where you plug into the wall. And this here is actually the tire cleaning pad. You just open this up when you're ready to clean your tires, rub it back and forth on the pad and your tires are ready to go. Now, of course, let's take a look at the cars. Here is Ground Shock. This car is awesome. Deep blue, a lot of detail, definitely looks like a futuristic kind of racing car. Here is Skull. He's got the skull and crossbones on top, got his name there over his driver's side fender, fins on the back. You can also see lights on the back where he is going to light up. Here you can see the tires, they're nice soft rubber as well as sensors that you will use that will help keep your car on the track. Here is Thermo. This did not come with the starter kit. It looks like his speed is awesome. His defense is a little low, firepower pretty strong, and right in the middle for mid. They also sent us Nuke. This would be an expansion car as well. This did not come with the starter kit. His speed is not great. His defense is pretty good. His firepower is super high, but his special is low. So here's what the cars look like on the charging base. You can see you get a glowing green light up top when they are charging. The cars do sit firmly in the base. They kind of snap in. That's how you know they are in there and that they are charging correctly. So we will let these cars charge up while we go and build our track. Let's get to building. So we have all of our startup kit pieces out of the track. This one that Hubby Spider is holding has our start and our finish line you could see on there. Super flexible and they go together just magnetically. Can't be any easier than that. Super cool. So this is what the app looks like once you have it downloaded. Please play Supercars Ground Shock and Skull on the charger. We have done that. Except we're using Let's get some basic info. And then it'll want your basic info. Once your profile is set up, the app takes you through a basic course of learning how to drive your car. You go through a basic loop track and practice lane changing, acceleration, deceleration, and firing your weapons. After that, you're ready to race. Before each race begins, the cars do an automatic scan of the track and actually learn the track that you have built. Keeps track of your laps on your iPad so you can see how much farther you have to go. This is lap 12, 13, looks like Papa Tiger's in the lead. My lap, Papa 
the Tigers cruising. 15, yeah! One! That little gray button right there, we were having problems connecting the cars. I pressed it once and then pressed it again, and I think it's kind of like a Bluetooth scanner. Um, after we pressed that, then the car connected. So if you have any problems connecting your car, just press that button there. Hopefully that'll help you out. Now we're gonna try out the launching pad. Let's see how the initial scan goes. So they okay. check out the boots Boost. there and they jump over. It's so cool! Boost. On your phone or electronic device, each color of the driver coordinates with the color of light on each car. I'm the winner! <laughs> and now we have our collision kit. They have to go through an intersection with the possibility of smashing and crashing. Me and Hobby Sis are gonna race it out, so let's see how it goes. Thermo versus Nuke. course action with two different cars. Subscribe for the world's best shows with learning fun. And don't forget, you can press the little info button in the top right corner to keep the hobby fun going. You don't want to miss another episode, so come on, press that button now.